Hey, what's going on YouTube? Um, show you guys um, how the Funkin' Audio 10 inch FASL sub sounds. Um, it's hooked up to a 200 watt uh, Rockford Fosgate amp, which, you know, realistically it always puts out more. It's around 260 watts. So it's getting around 260 watts. Um, and it's in a prefab box. I'll show you guys right now when it starts playing. And I'm, I'm going to play a couple songs, see if you guys see. Well, just so you guys see how it sounds and see what you guys think. So let's start this. Let me put track number one. in the car I know it's kind of dirty so you guys can see it doesn't really do any flex or any I mean you can kind of hear it shaking I mean you can feel it shaking also but it doesn't really do much I mean it's just a single 10 inch sub in a prefab box So hopefully you guys can kind of get an idea how it sounds like. I mean, it kind of moves the car. I know it moves that little, the back light, you know, the third light on top, the brake light, moves it a little bit. Um, like I said, it moves a little, moves the trunk a little. Um, it's not really that much. Like I said, it's only 250 watts or around there, not even maybe 200 watts, I don't know, on that FASL sub from Funkin' Audio. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, it's in a prefab box provided by Parts Express. The subwoofer and the cabling was provided by Dima.com over on, well, yeah, provided by Dima.com. It's uh, it's all Funkin' Audio, the wiring, 4-gauge wiring, the RCAs and all that stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video, just, just a like, quick preview video so you guys can see how it sounds like. It sounds pretty decent. It's not like the loudest subwoofer out there. It's not like a performance subwoofer. So don't expect like SPL numbers or like com competition on these subs. But yeah, so you guys, so just so you guys can get an idea how it sounds like, sounds pretty decent, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.